Did you know that there is a specific way to teach kids how to play? And it's called Play Skills Hierarchy. This is Neurodiversipedia, and we're going to talk about it. The Play Skills Hierarchy is just a bunch of steps teaching children how to play with each other. This is often used for kids with special needs who struggle with social skills and need to learn with a little bit more instruction how to play with each other and interact with others. First, it starts with kids playing alone, and then it moves on to your child watching other children play. So they learn a little bit how they're interacting with themselves or with the toys. Then you'll move next to each other and you'll do what's called parallel play. You're going to play next to each other. You're not playing with each other, but you're in each other's spaces and you're aware that each, each other are there. Next, you'll move on to sharing toys. That person who was once next to you and you were parallel playing next to each other, you'll start sharing blocks. Maybe you're going to ask each other, so, hey, can I borrow that? and you're increasing that social skills awareness. Finally, the last step, that's the same thing. Finally, children will make up games together, whether that's make-believe games or they'll play a puzzle together with already clear instructions. It's all about playing with each other and being flexible with how you're going to play. These levels of increased friendship or increased social skills are extremely important for kids with special needs it can be really useful for your child if they struggle with social settings. This hierarchy of play skills can actually be developed for not even just children. It can be for adults with developmental delays as well. You can actually help your child learn these social skills by enacting those steps. They're pretty simple. You let them play by themselves, and maybe they watch you play on the side. And then you parallel play. And then you share some toys. And then you create a new game together. Very, very simple, effective ways to teach social skills, especially for those who have special needs. Did that help you understand the term? If yes, give us a thumbs up or subscribe below. If it didn't, then leave us a comment and tell us why. What are we missing? We always want to do better. This is a project by Goalie. Check us out at getgoalie.com.